welcome to the second review of the evening. Up this time is Blastful. Um, we got the PlayStation 4 version of this game. Uh, I want to say that this was originally a mobile title. I didn't find it on the PC at the very least. Um, but anyway, uh, Blastful is a fast-paced arcade shoot-em-up. Enjoy crazy shooting action in procedurally generated visuals with retro style. Cyberpunk flavored techno beats. Blast your way through ten different types of enemies with five different weapons. Uh, yeah, the ad blurbs here are kind of short. <laughs> Take it away, Teddy. Do you like asteroids? Because this is an even worse version of asteroids. More like butteroids. Uh, maybe, because I don't know how well the streaming is portray portraying this, but the graphics are ass. Like, I can't even tell what the enemy ships are level of ass. That that mm. certainly is a, a larger than normal amount of uh, particle trails. For yep, 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 yeah. yep, yep, yep. For everything, actually. Going at, like... And the game's only at, like, maybe 40 frames per second, generously. <sighs> so, yeah, y your goal is get through the waves of enemies. You don't have to destroy them all. But there is a boss at the end you have to defeat to go to the next level. That's it. <laughs> You can occasionally get some weapon power-ups, health power-ups, and shield power-ups. And you have a generous health gauge, but you can also shoot in eight directions. Only eight, mind you. So, yeah, that that's fun. Could be worse. There's a weird radar system that I'm not sure exactly what it's for. And also, the bosses are laughable. They do not turn. So once you destroy their guns, they just sit there, fire forward while you're on the side of them, and you shoot them to death. I wish this was a bug. But this is actual the gameplay. And level's done. <laughs> so yeah, this game is not good. So you indicated. Uh, the music is meh. Granted, I'm not a, you know, big fan of the genre, so. Controls are hot garbage. What? You don't like cyberpunk and flavored it's cyberpunk whatever techno beats? Yeah, yeah, no. And yeah. The visuals, as we said, is yeah, no. I mean, they, they haven't given me a headache at least yet, so there is that. But I wouldn't call that a high achievement either. Um, As f for shooting, you can either hold the button to shoot steadily, or you can rapid fire by matching the button. There's no charge shot or anything like that. Um... All the face buttons fire in both the um, R2 and L2 fire. R1 and R2 are to switch weapons. And yeah. Any, any questions? Comments? Concerns? Can take that as a no. <laughs> Not really, yeah. Yeah, I don't have anything. <laughs> so, Adam, what's the price of this? <laughs> the pricing is three dollars ninety nine cents. Uh, yeah, no, I still no. It's there is no enjoyment here. There is no fun and merriment. This is just a terrible game. That is unfortunate. Yeah. Yeah, this is going to rank high on my worst of lists this year. 
<laughs> to the shock of absolutely no one. Yep. Anything else? Uh, if you're looking for an Asteroids type game to play, go get the Atari Collection. <laughs> Alright, uh, so I guess that'll about do it for Blastful here. Um, be sure to tune in uh, after the break as Galax will be reviewing The Lost Cube.